Beneath the waves, China has just shattered global expectations. For years, the Type 094 nuclear submarine was wrapped in secrecy until now. In a bold, unprecedented move, Beijing unveiled shocking details about its most powerful underwater weapon. Faster, deeper, and deadlier than anyone imagined, this submarine isn't just an upgrade, it's a strategic game-changer. Why did China choose this moment to break its silence? Let's dive deep into the truth behind the stealth giant. For years, the Chinese Type 094 nuclear-powered ballistic missile submarine, also known as the Gene class has operated in the shadows of the world's oceans. Its capabilities were mostly speculative, based on satellite images and occasional intelligence leaks. But that changed during a rare public event on April 23, 2025. During the Chinese Navy's open day, the People's Liberation Army Navy plan officially unveiled a suite of game-changing technical details about the Type 094, and for the first time, they didn't hold back. According to journalists from the South China Morning Post who attended the event, the improved Type 094 has a submerged top speed of 30 knots and an operational diving depth of 400 meters. These numbers are not just impressive, they exceed previous Western estimates by a wide margin. Until this point, defense analysts believed the Type 094 could only reach 20 knots and dive to 300 meters. That 50% increase in both speed and depth is a strategic leap that completely changes how we think about this submarine's survivability and reach. But how exactly did these enhancements come to be? It's likely due to major overhauls in propulsion and hull design. The submarine uses a pressurized water-cooled nuclear reactor, driving a steam turbine and a single shaft. Improvements could include quieter machinery, enhanced vibration insulation, and possibly pump jet propulsion a design used in U.S. and British submarines to reduce noise and cavitation. These quieting measures are critical because SSBNs like the Type 094 are built for one main purpose, to disappear into the deep ocean and wait. The jump in performance could indicate this is either a newly constructed variant or a heavily upgraded retrofit that has redefined what the Type 094 is capable of. Some sources suggest a Type 094B subclass may now exist, incorporating lessons from its predecessor but with a dramatically refined platform. The expansion from around 9,000 tons to 11,000 tons in submerged displacement also points to larger onboard systems, stronger structural reinforcements, or expanded living and missile compartments. The most critical element of any SSBN isn't just how well it hides, it's what it can launch. And here, the Type 094 has taken another enormous leap forward. Traditionally armed with 12 JL-2 submarine-launched ballistic missiles, SLBMs, the Type 094 has long been a key part of China's growing nuclear deterrent. The JL-2 has a range of approximately 7,000 kilometers, putting Hawaii, Alaska, in parts of the continental U.S. within reach from waters near China's coast. But now, new evidence strongly suggests that some Type 094 submarines have already been outfitted with the next-generation JL-3 SLBMs. While China has not confirmed this openly, multiple successful JL-3 test launches have been tracked by international observers since the late 2010s. And the numbers speak volumes. Up to 14,000 kilometers in range, double the reach of the JL-2. With that range, a Type 094 can strike targets across the entire U.S. mainland without ever leaving the relative safety of Chinese-controlled waters. This shift drastically changes China's strategic posture. Before, its subs had to patrol much farther into the Pacific to guarantee target coverage, which increased their exposure to U.S. and Allied detection systems. Now, with JL-3 missiles, those same submarines can sit comfortably within heavily defended zones, like the Yulin Naval Base on Hainan Island and still hold global cities at risk. There's more. Multiple defense analysts believe that the JL-3 may include MRV, multiple independently targetable reentry vehicle, technology. This means a single missile can carry multiple nuclear warheads, each programmed to hit a different target. MIRVs massively increase the destructive power and complexity of any nuclear strike, making interception far more difficult and deterrence far more credible. That's not all the Type 094 is packing. In addition to ballistic missiles, the submarine is armed with six 533mm torpedo tubes capable of launching U-6 torpedoes 
high-speed, wire-guided, and modeled after the U.S. Navy's negative 48 Malawian quatches. These give the Type 094 an effective anti-submarine and anti-ship defense layer, allowing it to fight back if detected or ambushed. By combining longer-range nuclear missiles, multiple warhead capabilities, and enhanced conventional defenses, the upgraded Type 094 shifts from being a cautious coastal defender to a powerful, credible second strike platform with global reach. One of the most intriguing questions in this entire story is timing. Why would China, a country known for intense secrecy around its strategic forces, suddenly reveal detailed specs of its most advanced nuclear submarine? After all, this is the very platform designed to stay invisible, to vanish into the deep without a trace. The answer lies in strategic signaling, a calculated move to project strength, both to the world and to its own citizens. The announcement didn't come via a leak or satellite discovery. It happened during an official Navy Open Day on April 23, 2025, a highly choreographed event designed to display strength and modernization. Media from Hong Kong's South China Morning Post were invited. Key stats like speed and diving depth were clearly communicated. The intention is obvious. China wants the world to know how far its naval deterrent has come. From a geopolitical lens, this is about deterrence. China is modernizing all three legs of its nuclear triad, land-based ICBMs, strategic bombers like the upcoming H-20 stealth bomber, and now its sea-based platforms. By showcasing its upgraded SSBNs, China is telling the US, India, and others, we're ready for any scenario, including a second strike if necessary. There's also a domestic angle. Revealing the enhanced capabilities of the Type 094 isn't just about military competition, it's a demonstration of technological achievement. It builds national pride, reassures citizens of national security, and promotes confidence in the country's military leadership. In a world where media optics matter as much as hardware, this was a statement move. Finally, there's the unspoken competition with the United States. The U.S. Navy has long maintained supremacy with its Ohio-class SSBNs, each carrying 24 Trident 2D-5 SLBMs. China's message is clear. While it may not match the U.S. sub for sub, its own platforms are getting faster, deeper, quieter, and armed with longer-range missiles that can hold their own. The unveiling of the Type 094's capabilities marks a significant milestone in China's naval development. With enhanced speed, depth, and missile technology, this submarine class represents a formidable component of China's strategic deterrent. The public disclosure not only highlights China's advancements in undersea warfare but also serves as a strategic communication tool, signaling its readiness to assert its interests on the global stage. As we navigate an increasingly complex geopolitical landscape, Understanding the capabilities and intentions behind such developments is crucial. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries, and don't forget to leave a comment below. Also, you can visit our website, spaceinews.com. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.